Number 36 and 37. We flew in on a five-hour flight from Atlanta to Portland. Got in the rental car. Do you like it? Yeah. We're in Oregon! Woo! Drove to Silver, Far Silver Falls State Park, I think. It had seven waterfalls. And it was awesome. Most of them you could go behind. Wow, look at that. We wish we could go swimming. All right, found the best swimming hole. Look at that pool. Doesn't awesome. that look nice? Every time we saw a new waterfall, it was my new favorite. And we hiked five and a half miles through a lush, old growth, moss covered forest with enormous evergreen trees, unlike anything we've ever seen. Douglas fir is the fastest growing of all the, all the conifers in the park. Well, they can grow up to 200 feet. What? Sometimes even taller. Holy moly, that is one big tree. What do you think, Chase? It's very big. It's huge. They are so big, when you look up at them, you get dizzy. This is so pretty, I love it. Love it, love it, love it. What about you, Graham? I go to play Fortnite. What? Yeah. No, I'm joking. Then we drove to Eugene, Oregon for a night in a hotel and donuts. Went to a donut place called Voodoo Donut. It was Awesome. Room called Marshall Matters, which was full of MMs. This is awesome. Not the best I've ever had, but they were amazing. It was a gorgeous drive to get to Crater Lake. We drove by lakes, through evergreen forests, and rose to high elevations. Oh, that scares me. That's awesome. We went to Crater Lake, which was 10 out of 10, amazing. And we hiked to the treacherous but scenic Crestwood Trail. It was very steep coming down. The walk down had views of Crater Lake all the way down. Prettiest lake I've ever seen. Crater Lake. Well, nine out of 10, it was freezing, like the coldest water daddy's ever been in and us. Woo! It was very cold. That's cold. That's very cold. It's cold. If you thought Superior was cold, jump in here. And I jumped off of a really high place head first. Whenever you're ready. Nice. No. I'm an idiot. Yeah. Oh man, that was fun. After visiting Crater Lake for the day, it was time to drive to California. We drove through beautiful mountains and forests, both dead and alive. Woo! I feel like we could touch it if we put our hands out. The redwood section of the drive was amazing. The trees are so majestic. Oh my gosh. Guys, this is so cool. We arrived in Crescent City, California, just in time to see the sunset over the Pacific. As soon as we woke up, I just had to take Matt and the boys to see the Pacific Ocean for their first time. This coastline is rocky and brimming with sea life. The tide pools were a ton of fun to explore and unlike anything that we've ever experienced. We saw some tidal pools. And I saw a 20 starfish. It's hard! It's a crab. Man, the turtle with claws. <laughs> it's rubbery. Oh, it feels like plastic. What is it, Chase? Probably. Kelp. 
We drove the gorgeous Pacific Coastal Highway to get to Fern Canyon. Fern Canyon Trail. What do you think, Graham? Cool. And Jurassic Park was filmed here. Walking through the deep creek bed, the walls are entirely covered in ferns in a bright, bright green. It's a really cool trail, and I jumped in, and I definitely regret it now. It was very cold. <laughs> wow! I got that on video. Are you behaving yourself? Um, maybe. We ended the day in the most incredible forest that we've ever walked through. We went on a hike at the Redwoods. And we hiked through the trees. Oh yeah, oh yeah, here he comes. It really was a walk among giants. So beautiful and definitely something that everyone should experience in their lifetime. And the trees were super big. Holy moly, these trees are huge! These are some big trees. They were very huge. Oh my gosh, guys, look at the trees that are growing on top of it. That is so cool. Chase, this is amazing. These trees. The biggest tree was like 200 or 300 feet tall. 1,500 years old. I can't believe how big these trees are. You're incredible. I fell off a redwood tree. Here's our injured list. Both of these guys. Let me see that nose, that chin. I can say I've touched the very top of a redwood tree. Hi! Flying the redwoods and Crater Lake and the waterfalls are my favorite things. One of my other favorite things is holding mom's hand and holding her half armpit. Three minutes to the beach to swim. Chase had been begging to go swimming, so we went to the swimming beach for his first swim in the Pacific Ocean. He loved it. Went to the marina and looked at the boats. We met a tuna and salmon fisherman who told us that a 10 day fishing trip can yield 25 tons of tuna and earn 75 to $100,000. We got little baby Grammy. <laughs> Later, we walked to Battery Point Lighthouse, which had panoramic views of the ocean and the beach. The tide pools were super exciting today. The boys kept finding starfish after starfish, and they were huge too. Oh, is that is that its bite? Yeah. <laughs> Let's see. Kiss it, kiss Turn it. it on the other side. No, it isn't its bite. It's eating. It's eating? They found so many that Chase started a collection and had over 20 in his community in a matter of minutes. Here's the starfish collector right here, Starfish King. We went to the secret, secret beach. After a steep walk down, we were rewarded with incredible views and a nearly deserted beach. This goes so far back. Next up was our favorite beach, Whales Head Beach. Wow, guys. We had the whole place ourselves. The beach was big, had very few people there, and offered the most scenic views. 
The rock formations were enormous and so pretty. Is that your new walk, Chase? Your new signature walk? I especially loved it when the fog started rolling in and totally changed the scenery. Crab claw. Come on, Let's see if Nora wants to eat it for lunch. Oh. What did Chase find? I got you something. Hi, Graham got me a flower. Love to Muscle with barnacles. I went swimming there with Graham. It was super fun, and the waves were big. We saw sea life, birds, and another sea cave today. Today we took Coastal Highway 101 to drive from Northern California to Northern Oregon. A route that was supposed to take six and a half hours ended up taking nearly 12 hours due to a crash that forced us to detour 150 miles. Even so, the drive was beautiful and we made many scenic stops along the way. Best truck on our trip! Look at this! It's Bigfoot covering Big his cross with a raccoon. <laughs> Dang it! I know, right? Good idea! <laughs> Oh, we need to be friends with this guy. That's it's amazing. I don't think we're, I don't think we're worthy. We're not worthy. <laughs> Maybe we'll get there one day. What well, windy for you? It's windy. <laughs> no. <laughs> After such a long drive, we were even more grateful to arrive in Rockaway Beach, Oregon. So at the place that we're at right now, um, we're on a beach, probably the nicest beach we've been to so far. The water is like almost too cold to swim in. What do we think it is? Oh, you think it's whale snot? Yes. <laughs> Chase, are you yeah. scared of it? We went down to the beach at like 10 o'clock. It was sunset and gorgeous. There's people having a fire. The lady, she was really nice. They let us use the fire. Awesome. Roasted marshmallows and they were really good. The fire made our sunset on the beach even better. We took a beautiful scenic drive up the coastal highway looking for more adventures. We landed at Nicolai State Park. Went on a hike and it was called Carson Beach. We got to see the Goonie Rock and hike three miles on the Crescent Beach Trail. We're going to Crescent. It was a beautiful walk through a fern and wildflower covered evergreen forest. Once we were at the beach, there were gorgeous rocks to scramble on, sea life, and sea caves to explore. It was pretty big, and we couldn't find no one. We just looked back, and no one wasn't there. And I didn't realize it, but they ended up walking all the way across the beach and found like these water caves. We visited some caves to go to the other side. Wow! Cool. I found a lot of um, rocks. Wow, those are so pretty. Good find, Graham. 
It was very fun. Ate lunch at a seafood place that was really good. Mary and Berry Cobbler is a berry made in Oregon by Oregon for people in Oregon. Sadly, we've come to our last full day of our trip. We left coastal Oregon and headed to Portland. The city of Portland, Oregon. Later, we walked to Washington Park to check out the stunning Rose Gardens. The gardens were much, much bigger than I expected and had such a variety of roses. Let me see who knows how to drink out of a water fountain. <laughs> no, don't touch. My favorite part of the trip was all of our hiking. I loved our hiking, especially our hike through the redwoods. And I also really loved the tide pools. Those were cool. My favorite were the hikes and the flight, probably, and the food. The food, the redwoods, and then Crater Lake. My favorite part of the trip was flying. Graham, I thought for sure it was going to be my half armpit, my cold half armpit. <laughs> Number one, most scenic, most beautiful trip we ever took. And I love that we got to see states somewhere 36 and 37, Oregon and California. Woo woo! Woo woo!